Hey everyone, thanks for checking out another bonus episode of The New Marketing Show. Catch us on Instagram TV, YouTube, Facebook, our website, all that great stuff. We definitely appreciate you. We appreciate you guys being with us through all this. We hope every, this video finds everybody well. And we are all you know moving forward together in a positive manner. So I'm going to talk to you about <clears throat> one of the simplest things when it comes to digital marketing, when it comes to WordPress, and when it comes to kind of, you know, keeping your sanity here and I know that I've done videos on this before but I just want to really drive home how important this is the importance of backups now we use a paid plugin called backup buddy to back up all of our sites and all of our client sites what that does is we can schedule it to back the site up as a full backup both theme and database on at any scheduled duration <clears throat> so one thing is, why would you want to do that? You want to do that because you want to make sure that you always have a current version saved of your site somewhere. You never know what's going to happen. You know, your server could go down. Your, you could get hacked. You could have, you know, a, a DDoS attack. You could, have, you could mess up the site by making edits or doing different things or introducing new plugins. The fact that you have a backup is going to give you some sanity and it's going to give you some margin for error when you're operating with your own site <clears throat> now we always advise everybody to back up the site you know in the same duration as you post content so if you post content weekly make sure you have a weekly backup if you post it monthly make sure you have a monthly backup you know and a lot of times what you need to do is and when i say that what you want to do is you want to make sure you have a database backup because content is stored within the database. And if you have a database backup, you're going to be good. Now, when you make big theme changes, you know, you may make uh, some CSS ch code changes to the native files of the theme, the child theme. You know, you may alter the functions PHP file to make sure that, you know, it's doing some new, giving your site some new functionality. As soon as you do that, you can make sure that I definitely have a friend here. Make sure that what you're doing is you back up the theme. So database holds the content. The theme is all part of, you know, the aesthetics and how it looks. Most web good web hosts will have a backup of your site, but it may not be of the duration and the restore point that you need it to be. So what we like to do is we definitely like to make sure that we have a local one saved always. And then when we use Backup Buddy, you know, we just schedule it out. And what happens is we can have that go ahead and go to Dropbox or it can go anywhere offline. They can email it to us. Just making sure that we have what we need. So thanks for watching. Cleo says, I don't know what Cleo is saying, but thanks for watching and we will talk to you soon. Bye.